Good morning children. Let us practice more examples of LCM using the prime factorization method. First, let us revise how to find the LCM by prime factorization method. For this, find the prime factorization of given numbers. Then, find the common factors. Next, find the other factors meaning find the uncommon factors of the given numbers and lastly multiply the common factors and the uncommon factors and you will get the LCM. Understood? Now let us find the LCM of 12 and 80 using the prime factorization method. Let us start with 12 first. So, 12. Now, 12 is an even number. So, we can divide by 2 which is the least even prime number. So, 2, 6 are 12. Now, 6 again is an even number. So, 2, 3 is 6. Here, 3 is a prime number and it is divisible by itself. So, 3 1s are 3. So, here we did the prime factorization of 12. All the divisors are prime numbers. So, prime factorization of 12 is equal to 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 3. Next, we do the prime factorization of 80. 80 is an even number. So, we will try to divide it by 2 which is the least even prime number. 2 40s are 80. Now, 40 again is an even number. So, 2 20s are 40. Again, we get the quotient as an even number. So, 2 10s are 20. Again, 2 5s are 10. Now, 5 is a prime number and it is divisible by itself. So, 5 1s are 5. Here we did prime factorization of number 80 and as you can see, all the divisors are prime numbers. So, 80 is equal to 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 5. So, this is the prime factorization of 80. Now, let us find the common factors of 12 and 80. We found out 12 is equal to 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 3 and 80 is equal to 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 5. Now, which are the common factors here? We can see 2 and 2. So, 2 and 2 are the common factors of 12 and 80. Next, let us find the other factors of 12 and 80 meaning let's find the uncommon factors these are 3 2 2 and 5 so 3 2 2 and 5 are the other or uncommon factors of 12 and 80 now how to get the LCM of 12 and 80 for this we multiply the common factors and we multiply the uncommon factors and we get the LCM. So, LCM is the product of common factors and the uncommon factors of the given numbers. This is equal to 240. So, now you know how to find the LCM of given numbers using the 
prime factorization method that is all for now bye bye children